I'm Chrissy Dickerson. I'm a novelist, which makes me both a producer and a consumer for libraries. And I came today really because I'm interested in what's going to become of something as important to someone like me as libraries. You know, one of the things you write for is to actually have people read and understand what you're saying. It's like a kind of conversation. And libraries are one of the main places where that happens at the moment. My name's Jonathan Douglas. I'm director of the National Literacy Trust. Um, this morning was very exciting in as much as we saw projected some of the social trends and wider influences that will determine what the future of libraries will be over the next decade. And I think in the afternoon, one of the things which I'm most looking forward to discussing really is whether it's possible to hold on to a national identity for libraries when clearly the trends suggest that actually the service will become more localised and more fragmented in the future. I'm Nigel Thomas. I'm from Leicestershire County Council and my job is Head of Service for Delivery for the Library Service. Well, we had a really interesting discussion um, just after the presentation. More and more people are beginning to use online channels and therefore opportunities for pulling people together to um, interact and communicate with each other are going to be more challenging. I'm Andrew Coburn. I'm here on behalf of the Library Campaign, which is a charity for friends and users of libraries. The morning session was interesting. It was useful to be reminded of the, the statistics and it was a reminder of what library services can do. One of the things that I, that I wanted to, to make sure got discussed that is the political context of all the statistics and the research and the demographics. I'm Martin Palmer from Essex Libraries. Um, I think the main thing that came across this morning was the huge range of stuff that people have to take into account for the future of libraries. So I think one of the challenges at the moment um, is um, that some people think you know, that libraries can all be delivered online. Um, and that kind of loses the kind of social value of libraries as a public meeting place and the place where everybody comes together. Um, my name's Lauren Lucas. I'm a policy manager at the Local Government Information Unit. We've talked a lot about need today and I think that, that need comes from the local community um, and in future you are going to see a much more, more of a diversity of provision at a local level. Uh, my name is Sarah. Uh, I represent uh, Public Library Research at University uh, and also uh, a radical public library service called the Itinerant Poetry Library. I found it very enjoyable to see all the very passionate people who are involved in the public library service um, and for everyone to come together in a room and be able to talk about um, some of the issues. My name is Ruth Taylor, I work for Artswork and I'm one of the strategic bridge managers and libraries will be having to repurpose themselves but keeping that core of their, the local entitlement, the entitlement to people.